You cannot trust the narcissist family members. You may wonder if the narcissist family members know how the narcissist acts and behaves. If they know what the narcissist is planning to do. And yes, they do know. They've seen the narcissist do this again and again. And when you first meet their family members, they're smirking. They have this pleasure and self-satisfaction at your unhappiness and misfortune. Because they already know what's about to happen to you. They know what to expect. They know what you're likely to receive. But they pretend like everything is okay. When they already know what's about to happen to you. They know that you're about to be involved in a surprising and difficult situation. But they're not going to say anything. They will play the role. They will act like you are very special. Like you are surpassing what is common or usual. To make you feel like you are desired and approved of. Like you're in a good position. But you're not. The narcissist family is just playing a role. They're putting on an act. And they're just waiting to see how the narcissist is going to destroy you. They're not going to save you. They're not going to persevere or deliver you from harm, ruin or loss. They're going to watch it all take place. One of the biggest mistakes you could make is to confide in the family members of a narcissist. That won't achieve anything because they're on the narcissist's side. So when you tell their family members about a secret or private matter while trusting them not to repeat it to other people. All they do is tell the narcissist. And then they're laughing at you. And then the narcissist has the advantage. They have the position of power and control. They have the upper hand. so that they can adapt to everything that you thought you were confiding in. If you have figured out what you're dealing with and you've cut the narcissist off, you need to be aware that they're all colluding 
and conspiring together secretly. They're all working together and making plans together in secret. They're all cooperating behind your back in order to deceive and gain an advantage over you. So everything you confide in them is going to go back to the narcissist. The narcissist is going to know everything about it. You're just giving the narcissist information and advice to help them defend or attack a viewpoint argument or claim. And the family already knows what's going to happen. They're familiar with the situation and they know how it will usually progress. They work as a team. So when you've cut the narcissist off and got no contact, do not stay in contact with their family members. Because they're all in on it. They're all sharing in the knowledge of something secret and private. They're all informed. They're all participating in it. They will play the role. They will put on an act like they're so concerned. Like they have a responsibility for you. And they have to involve themselves in the situation. Because they want to solve the problem. They want you to come to an agreement. But it's all a facade. It's a deceptive outward appearance. Their family members don't care about you. They're not concerned about you. They don't have an interest in you. They want the narcissist to screw it up. They want the narcissist to destroy you. That's exactly what they want. Thank you for watching. I hope the video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.